today's video i am going to talk about a very interesting topic horoscope so let's see how we can get our horoscope using python now to perform this entire activity we need to use some place from where we can extract the information and i am using horoscope.com so here you can see that all the zodiac signs are listed over here these are around 12 yeah and you can click on any of these let's say if i'm clicking on scorpio you can see that yesterday today tomorrow weekly and monthly these are the various horoscope you can read using this website and let's say if i'm looking for tomorrow's horoscope i can simply click on tomorrow and the information would be displayed over here now on the top you can see that the url is generated so this url contains few useful pieces of information so here you can see that daily and then tomorrow because we are looking for tomorrow if you are looking for today then it will give you the link something like daily hyphen today and at the end you can see the integer which is sign equal to 8 so this 8 represents Scorpio as per this website so these are the uh, let me go back and show you 12 different zodiac signs are having their unique 12 numbers and that's what we are going to use today to perform this particular action so let's see how we can perform this thing using python now as we are doing web scrapping we need two important things requests and the beautiful soup so you need to install this using pip and then get it imported over here once these are imported, we need to perform the mapping between the integer number and the actual string which is representing horoscope. So this is the one which I have already created for you. So we will just utilize this particular information and perform the mapping. Next thing is we need to get the user input that which sign he is looking for. So for that we can create a variable Jodic symbol and we can ask user to provide the input then we need to ask whether he's looking for today tomorrow or which day so for that you can again create a variable day and then ask for the required input now the another thing which is very important is to construct the particular url so for constructing the url we can create a variable let's say i have created a result and inside the requests get function we are going to pass this so i am using f because i want to concatenate the string at the runtime and here i'm passing day which is today tomorrow yesterday and this is where we have the number and this mapping we are getting it from uh, this particular zodiac signs so once this is done we are good to go with this url and the only thing which is remaining is we need to extract the information using our html parser and that's where we have beautiful soup for our rescue so once this is done we can go and say okay get me the required div tag so that i can extract the complete information out of it so here i am having div tag and the main dot horoscope so let me remove this okay and if i will go ahead and say print you can see that the output is displayed over here so let's wait for a second it is executing okay it is asking enter zodiac sign so let me go ahead and say leo okay and which day are you looking for so i'm looking for today and as soon as i did today horoscope is displayed over here so here you can see uh, let me scroll it a bit okay it's not happening but let me rerun it so that we can see complete text in one shot okay this time i will again say leo and i'm looking for today so you can see that this is june 6 2022 and this is what that website is saying as a horoscope for leo so this is how easy it is to know your horoscope using the given website i hope you enjoyed the short video and thanks for watching